You know, like every five years, there's a movie that comes out about aliens. I'm not into sci-fi. Did I ask if you were into sci-fi? No, but it sounded like you were about to go off on a whole sci-fi thing, and it's annoying when people do that, and then I don't have the context to understand what they're even talking about, because it's all based on these other universes with their own laws that have nothing to do with laws of our universe. Are you familiar with the concept of there being movies about aliens? Vaguely. Awesome, because that's literally all the context necessary to understand my point. Okay. Great. They make these films. Well, now it feels stupid. Oh, I love that. As soon as you get my attention, you want to back away. Fine. Well, I heard this actor. Ooh, who was it? It's not important. I know, but I want to have a picture in my head. Well, I don't remember. What? Do you think I remember? Honestly, yes. <laughs> it's Robert Downey Jr. Oh, he seems like he'd be really pretentious. But that's what I was hoping. But in a longer form conversation, he was actually kind of charming. That makes sense. They asked him some question about why people love movies with aliens. The dubious premise. And he said he thinks it's because, you know, every kid dreams of being an astronaut. When I was a kid, I wanted to be an oven. But that can't be it, right? Because literally no kid has wanted to be an astronaut for the last, like, 800 years. Correct. And I was thinking about it. Like, what are we if not these things that have been thrust into this strange, huge place just completely unprepared? We don't know what the rules are, and everyone around us seems to know them, or at least they know that there are rules, even if it means nothing. It seems like we're alone, and that if there's anyone out there that is like us, that they must be somewhere really far away. I realized we don't relate to the astronauts because we know, on some level, we're the aliens. How high are you? Literally. You know what I mean?